your number one news team covering the North. The Bahamas Tonight, Northern Edition. Welcome back. Generations Ministry based in Denver, Colorado, on the ground in Grand Bahama to assist families and churches with home repairs. Director Kevin Swanson says it is a gospel-based ministry which encourages families and churches to follow Jesus. He says they came to Grand Bahama to spread the love of God through service. This to be a great opportunity to follow Jesus and what Jesus would do, and that is the redemption, the rebuilding of a island that has been devastated by a hurricane. And uh, this is a tremendous opportunity for Christian ministries and churches and families to uh, pitch in and to rebuild um, this massive devastation that's happened as a result of Dorian. Swanson says they're renovating churches, working with those who do not have insurance, widows and single mothers. He says they're partnering with these churches to render the necessary help and he's encouraging persons to go to the place of worship if they are in need of assistance. We have at least three to four teams scheduled uh, over the next several weeks. So we're just going to be working hopefully nonstop for the next six months or, or a year. Um, and we are shipping materials. We have shipped 150,000 pounds of materials, drywall, shingles and such. Kyle Edwards, the president of VIP Hugs International, a nonprofit organization along with Halo and Hearts are joining forces to host a major distribution. Edwards says the distribution will be held on the grounds of Le Chateau on the Green on Friday, January 23rd, between the hours of 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. We have been doing this for a while now, but um, we're getting everything out and we're making, we want to make sure that the uh, items go to the right people. We've done this before, so um, most importantly, the items go to the right people. So we want groups, churches, um, nonprofit organizations to come here and come with the box and we will come and let them get whatever they need. Um, we already been and have a, a, the things um, situated separate so they can come and whatever they need, pampers, uh, soap, uh, whatever, everything is organized and uh, they can come and pick it up. Halo and Hearts representative Ron Bad says that they are in Puerto Rico assisting with rebuilding efforts, but it was also important to come to Grand Bahama as well. I've come here to help with the distribution of all these products and that, and, and also to help uh, uh, look at the... <clears throat> I've also come here to look at evaluating some of the rebuilding process, because that's what we've been doing in Puerto Rico, is rebuilding roofs and helping families get back into their homes. And that's a look at stories making news this evening. Jay, what's coming up in sports? Well, I did hear you used to be a very good softball player back at Florida Memorial <laughs> University. But softball and baseball is happening next. Some young, talented players receive some very good donations over the Christmas. Okay, sounds exciting. Stay with us. Jay Philippe has a check on sports while we come back.